How you doing, Cancer? Hope you're doing well. Hope this reading finds you well. Um, thanks for your likes, your shares, your subscribes, your donations, your personal reading requests. Don't forget to leave a like if you like the video and tap the bell notifications for when you want to be notified when I'm uploading more content. Um, this is a reading for you for the 25th of April through to the 2nd of May. Let's crack on. I'm going to pull you some oracle cards and then some tarot cards. And we'll see what the tarot wants you to know. Ooh. Pisces just got frustration. No, 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 they didn't. No, they didn't. I apologise. But stop trying to fit a square peg in a round hole, especially if it just won't go. Cleanse. Detoxify. Cleanse yourself. Okay, Cancer? Mmm. Wow. Balance and flow. Balance and flow. I mean, these two things go together like kibbles and bits, don't they? Because when you have balance, you can get in the flow. Allow things to flow for you. So definitely try to step away from, cleanse yourself from frustration and get into balance and flow. Oh yeah, some angel wisdom tarot. Ace of Swords. Well, that's our three. And, okay, I'm going to take four. Hmm. King of Cups. Ooh. The star and the moon. The star and the moon. Well, this is definitely talking about timing of the divine to do with celestial bodies to get the star and the moon like that. Okay, so Ace of Swords. Let's have a look at this Ace of Swords. Brilliant ideas that may need refinement. Overcoming obstacles with faith that everything will work out. Communicate clearly and concisely and remain objective. What have we got for the King of Cups? Trustworthy, honorable, devoted, cautious, someone you can completely trust. A situation that is safe. A solid romantic relationship, hidden but well-intentioned emotions. King of Cups, he has great control over his emotions. A charitable benefactor, seeing a counsellor, who is honourable, trustworthy, devoted. Wow, and to get the star and the moon next. Incredible. That's a fantastic image, isn't it? Pouring her jugs out onto the land. Well, and as you can see, one is going to the water, one is going to the land. Have faith. The future is bright. Okay, Cancer? The future is bright. Dreams come true. Positive changes that bring an end to challenging times. The light at the end of the tunnel. The moon. Listen to your intuition and pay attention to signs from the divine. Okay, that's important. Unnecessary worry. Are you worrying unnecessarily? Possibly, because you've got the frustration card here. Let go of your fears. 
Revelations that will make everything clear. So a moment of clarity coming in for you, Cancer. Let's pull you some tarot cards. Okay, so we've got the Knight of Wands straight up. So someone, something coming into your life or leaving your life quite quickly. Six of Wands. A victory coming into your life quite quickly. Six of Pentacles. Two sixes in a row, right at the beginning of the reading. That's fantastic. So you're on the right track. Seven of Pentacles, running suited numbers. That's also brilliant. I love to see that. And it's been showing up in the readings reasonably frequently, considering how, you know, it's not like as rare as hen's teeth, but it's rare. The chariot is next, Cancer. The chariot rider has the magician's wand, so he does have the power of manifestation. And maybe he's manifesting a quality, a quality job. A job that he's going to enjoy. A job that we can all enjoy, in fact. Eight of Pentacles, wow. Three of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles together is definitely talking about a job that you can enjoy, a job that you are going to like. King of Wands, probably involving a fire sign. Wow, you've got the Ace of Swords again. So I'm going to read, read out, because this is important. I'm going to read this out again. Brilliant ideas that may need refinement, overcoming obstacles with faith that everything will work out. Communicate clearly and concisely and remain objective. The sun, after the Ace of Swords, wow. Amazing. And then you've got the Nine of Cups. Okay, Cancer, so make a wish. Make a wish in this moment. Make a wish right now. And your final card is... Interesting card to end on. <laughs> Something is dead, done and over with. Your past life. Frustration is dead, done and over with. Now, very important, Cancer. This is a brilliant reading. Don't let this card ruin it. I like to see this card because it, it is the end of something. Something is over. Okay? Very, very important. I mean, please... If I find out that you've allowed that one card at the end there to ruin this reading, I'll, 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 something. I'm not going to say what I'm thinking. Seriously, double sixes, the sun. I mean, it just doesn't really get much better than that. And I was getting a really good feeling about it as well, Cancer. Okay, take care. Peace be the journey. Click. Forever though. Oh,